Welcome everyone to my YouTube channel, it's Moudin again and today we're going to solve a useful step one U word question of the biochemistry block A research scientist is studying biochemical reactions that take the place in the liver He cultures hepatocytes in a growth media enriched with glutamate labeled with the nitrogen isotopes after some time, he finds that the nitrogen isotopes are transferred to oxaloacetate, forming aspar aspartate in the process. Which of the following substances is most likely involved in this reaction? The correct answer here is D, which is pyridoxin, because uh, transamination reactions typically occur between an amino acid and an alpha keto acid. The amino group from the amino acid is transferred to the alpha keto acid, and the alpha keto acid in turn becomes an amino acid. Pyridoxophosphate, which is the active form of vitamin D, serves as a cofactor in the amino acid transamination and decarboxylation reactions. And now we're going to read the UWOD explanation. It says that pyridoxin vitamin B6 is necessary for the transamination and decarboxylation of amino acids, for gluconeogenesis, and for other essential biochemical processes. Transamination reactions typically occur between an amino, amino acid and an alpha keto acid, as we've said previously. The amino group is transferred to the alpha keto acid to, uh, from the amino acid and the alpha keto acid, thereby becomes an amino acid. For example, glutamate amino acid reacts with the oxaloacetate, which is the alpha keto acid, to form aspartate, the resulting amino acid. And an alpha ketoglutarate, which is the resulting alpha keto acid. Transaminases which are the amino transferases, are the enzymes that catalyze the transamination reaction, and pyridoxal phosphate, the active form of vitamin D, serve as essential cofactor for the transaminase. And those are my accounts, and thank you for watching.